So let's move in. We've all more than likely sat down um, at some point this week and watched one of the governor's daily news conferences. Every time we're told about how crucial our role is in flattening the um, curve. And as we know, we expect more cases. But how though? Day. How can one person play a vital role in stopping the spread? Well, take this guy for example. We'll call him Junior. Junior here just got back from a trip and he doesn't know it now, but he actually has the novel coronavirus. He just won't start showing symptoms for another three to seven days. In some cases, he might not even show symptoms for about two weeks. In epidemiology, the rate of how quickly a virus spreads is called the virus's r naught. COVID-19 has an r naught of 2.2. Now, for the sake of this, we're just going to round that down to two. But what that essentially means is that for every person that has COVID-19, they're more than likely going to pass it on to two people. Now, let's get back to Junior. He decides to ignore social distancing guidelines and hang out with some friends now that he's back in town. Junior not showing any symptoms unknowingly spreads that to two people since the r naught is two. Now this is where the curve comes into play. Those two people Junior infected will each infect two other people. Then those two will infect two, that's four. Those four will infect two, that's eight. Eight becomes 16, then 32, 64. And that number just keeps multiplying until thousands are infected. And while Junior and many of these other folks are healthy and young, Mama over here is not. And now she has COVID-19. Her granddaughter unknowingly gave it to her and her granddaughter doesn't really even know Junior. Now here's what flattening the curve means. Let's say these four folks social distanced properly, washed their hands and took all the necessary steps to stay healthy. Now take a look, all these people may not need to use hospitals or even get tested because they avoided it. Now Mama never even came in contact with someone that had it. Social distancing helps spread the cases out over time so there won't be a huge spike. So that there will be enough beds and supplies in local hospitals for people who are like Mama and need it. And here's just some food for thought. Not that some of these folks wouldn't get the coronavirus from someone else, but look what would have happened if as soon as Junior got back, he isolated himself for a couple weeks. Exactly. He stopped and slowed the spread.